Hi, I'm Matt with Replacement Skylights. Today we're gonna to go over a video on how to replace a curb-mounted skylight. This homeowner is upgrading their old acrylic dome skylight with a new Velux double-pane insulated glass skylight. And you can see the first thing we need to do is just remove these roofing nails and or screws that are holding the skylight to the curb. You can see in this diagram, the skylight sits atop the curb made of wood studs like a lid over a box. It is secured to the curb with screws or nails from the side. So this skylight was just held in with a few nails. So now that we've got the skylight off the curb, we can remeasure just to make sure we've got the right size. And you can see here we're measuring from the outside of the flashing to the outside of the flashing. Flashing is sheet metal that waterproofs the transition from the roof deck up the curb. The only time it's necessary to replace out the flashing is if it's leaking at the roof level. For more information and to order new Velux flashing kits, visit replacementskylights.com. But for today's installation, there are no roof leaks, so the flashing remains and we're just replacing the skylight. Okay, so we've got the two old skylights off the roof. Um, so these old acrylic domes, they're just made from plastic. And you can see how much more quality these Velux glass skylights are. This is um, 5 8 inch thick dual glazed glass um, versus just thin plastic domes. So a lot more energy efficient for, for your house. So the next step before we put these skylights on is um, we just need to clean the inside of the glass before we install it because uh, it'll be a lot harder to reach once it's uh, way up high on the ceiling. So we use rubbing alcohol to get the glue on the glass that's left off from the manufacturing process. So once we've transported the new glass skylights to the roof and cleaned them, they're ready to be installed. You can see how the inside of the Velux skylight has a rubber gasketing system. This compresses down on top of the curb and gives it an airtight fit. So the skylight just sits over the curb, just like that. So once the skylight's sitting over the curb, it's ready to be screwed in place. We're using inch and a half self-tapping screws. You just want to make sure you don't use a screw that doesn't go so far uh, and poke through the drywall on the inside. And one thing you always want to do when you're screwing it in is to push down on the skylight. That helps compress it and make it airtight. And that's it. The skylights are good to go. They're all waterproofed and ready to go. You don't have to do anything else. Please visit replacementskylights.com for more information and order your new Velux glass skylights today.